Hi, this is Stephanie March from Minneapolis St. Paul Magazine, and I'm here to give you a video tour of some of the best restaurants in the Twin Cities. Today we are here at Bar La Grassa, and this is pretty much the scene of the moment in the cities. Isaac Becker and his team have put together a restaurant that is casual and cool and fun and cranks out an amazing array of Italian dishes. Some of the food we have spiced, carpaccio bruschetta that has a very nice cardamom touch to it. Gnocchi with cauliflower that is just smelling incredible. The camarata pasta with tuna, it's a dry pasta and it's got a fiery sauce on it. So these are some of the examples of the great dishes you can come and get at Bar La Grassa. Lenny Russo's Heartland is one of the best restaurants in St. Paul, but it's also one of the best restaurants to showcase Midwest flavor. Lenny, a native New Yorker, I might add, takes a look at our Midwestern cuisine, and he puts a polish on it, he uses creativity, and he brings out the best of our local flora and fauna. The addition of the Heartland Wine Bar also shows that in a more casual way, Lenny knows for whom he cooks. Sustainable seafood is on everybody's mind, and nobody does it better like the guys at Sea Change. Tim McKee brought in a hugely talented team, and now, just instead of free theater dining, Sea Change has become a destination spot. Their raw bar is maybe one of the best examples of a forward-thinking raw cuisine that you can find anywhere. They're not just fine with oysters and cold shrimp. They have creations that will knock your socks off. D'Amico Kitchen and Osteria is truly another reinvention that we are extremely happy for in the Twin Cities. They've taken the stuffiness that was at the old D'Amico Cucina out and they've just upped the vibe, upped the plating, everything is precise, everything is lovely, and not to mention it is so good. Flavors are just simple but they're chic and it's one of the best in the D'Amico empire. Saffron is a great example of what else is out there. Same Wade is one of the up-and-coming chefs of the area. He every night comes into that kitchen and dishes out amazing exotic spices and flavors and puts something in front of you that you may have never seen before. You can go for the lamb brain if you want to, but you can also find things that are familiar like kofta meatballs or the deviled eggs with the preserved tuna. Those are huge winners. To find out who else is in our top 10 for 2010, you're going to want to pick up the March issue on newsstands now because you want to get a piece of this.